hey guys this is Xamarin guys so in this tutorial we are going to create list view cells using MBBM approach so this is my list view which is using MBBM approach so let us create a new project that is our .NET standard project you will not see model view view model folder at first we will create it later this is our code behind of app.jml where I am setting my home as my starting page that is our main page using my project.views that is our views will contain that my home page that is in order to create that folder we will select a new folder and give it name as views this is a naming convention and then create a new file and then add a new page that is our content page.jml and then give it name as my home that is we are going to set our my home page as our starting page now inside our my home.jml here we will create a simple list view you can see over here we have already discussed in our previous tutorial that list view will contain some item source so the item source will get all the, its collection details from our given view model so we will implement some item templates you can see over here creating a simple text cell where text cell will contain details as well as text you can see in the right side that text is equals to binding home name that is our orchid house that is our binding home name and then binding home detail is the detail that is going to be presented for the given orchid house so this binding my home detail collection will collect all the binding home detail as well as binding home name inside a given text cell so our my home detail collection home detail as well as home name are the destination which are going to receive all its data from the given view model so let us quickly bind our given views with the given view model using this statement that binding context is equals to new home view model that is defined inside our project.viewmodel folder this is our view model folder that I have created it so this is my view model folder and then I have created a new class as homeviewmodel.cs this is my code behind for our given view model as in our previous tutorial we have collected all our data in the given list so inside this project we are going to collect all this data inside our my home detail collection that will get all this data from observer collection that is defined inside system.collection.object model which will collect all its content from home model class that is our property that are defined inside our model class so these are properties that are defined as id home name as well as home details you have to remember that the given view model will receive all the properties that is id home name as well as home detail from this class and then this home name as well as home details should be similar to the binding name that is defined inside our my home.jml in our given view model my home detail collection that is our item source that is defined inside our binding property of main page.jml will collect all its data properties from the given home model class and then create an observable collection so that id home name as well as home detail will set to some specific values so our home name as well as home detail will act as a source for the given cells that is defined inside our my home.jml and receive content from it here i have set multiple ids for the given view cell so that we could display some long list of view cells now let us build and run our project it should give me same output as expected i'll be giving code in the description below you can check that later if you are facing any problem then don't forget to comment it down below we'll solve that problem together that's all Thank you guys, thanks for watching. Keep in touch for next tutorials.